What's going on, guys? This is John O'Connor from the Behind the Barricade podcast. I am with some of the members from Finch. I'm Grizzly. I play guitar in Finch. Oh, yes. Uh, I'm Daniel. I play the bass. Nice, nice. What's going on, guys? Anything besides this warped? <laughs> it's another day on Warped Tour. It's our final day on Warped Tour, though, which yeah. is, I think, either cause for celebration or maybe... Or maybe I'll shed a tear later. Yeah. A little bittersweet, right? Yeah, a little yeah. bit. I'll miss, actually, I'll miss all the, the nice production people and the people from catering. Everyone's been really great to us on the tour, so. Yeah, I mean, it was pretty cool. You know, I just caught your set earlier. You guys gave a round of applause to the crew and stuff like yeah. that. I feel like not that many people actually do that. You know? Yeah, and honestly, you're like the meanest person I've met on Warp Tour this whole time. Like, everyone's so... I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> no, you've been good. Well, the interview's done. Thanks, guys. Uh, no, actually, yeah. The, we did Warp Tour in 2002, which was... Like the, I think the eighth year warp tour, and like they've gone leaps and bounds since then. Like I definitely see the store like you know get better at touring and stuff. So I, I do appreciate all. Of them. Wow, believe it or not, that was my first question. <laughs> right here, here we are at Warp Tour, and if I got my information right, this is the first time in over a decade. I think O2 was last time. Did anything change? Well, yeah. we got one answer. <laughs> yeah, anything anything definitely better. Yeah. yeah, the bands have changed. I was hoping for Lagwagon and No Effects, but <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they changed a little bit. Yeah. But you know, we weren't disappointed. We got Save the Day and Less and Jake, which yeah, yeah. have been yeah. a, two yeah. Warp veterans, just like yeah. yourselves. Yeah. So there's our, so much moshing and hardcore. Going on out there, it's like hard though. Like, yeah. It's hard. It's dangerous to walk around. Warped Tour. <laughs> yeah. I, I mean, it's it's plus it's all the same like music too. It's like dun 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 dun. Yeah. Back in two thousand two, all you had to worry about was like your feet getting stepped on from people like pogoing for doing oh, less yes. jig. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So uh, since you guys are the veterans on this tour and have seen a lot of new bands already, uh, any bands that uh, you've seen that have the same like fire and passion as you, like younger bands? Uh, that's a negative. Wow. <laughs> yes. no, I'm just kidding. Screw them all, I'm yes. Just kidding. Um, finch, Finch, Finch. <laughs> no, I'm yeah. joking. The, um, the dudes in the Ghost Inside are like definitely shred every day. Oh, yeah. They're super intense. Our friend uh, Jim is in it, and it's funny to see him so intense for like 35 minutes because he's like relatively goofy and like very dry witted throughout the set, like throughout the day, but. He turns it on when he gets up there, which is hey, cool. It's, I think, the same with, um, what's the name, Mike from the Devil Wars Prada. Yeah. You know, it's a really chill guy in a Nazi. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah definitely. All those guys, actually, they're always just behind their, their bus, like, shotgunning beers all day. <laughs> and then they go up and get crazy. Yeah, crazy area. Yeah. Crazy kids. <laughs> so, uh, one of these newer bands that played the Warp Tour, I hear, Lincoln Park. Yeah. As a, uh, yeah. <laughs> They're gonna be something from there. Yeah, they, they might be. So they keep at it. Yes, yes. They keep at it and you know eat their Wheaties, say their prayers, whatever Hulk Hogan says. So how did that whole thing come about with Nate doing uh, one step closer with Lincoln Park? I think they reached out to us. Really? Wow. Yeah, yeah. and they asked if uh, I think they had planned on having multiple singers, and yeah. I, I'm not sure why they did that, but they asked if Nate wanted to do it, and he said yeah, and it was wow. as simple as that. So. Yeah. <laughs> they literally. Really, like rehearsed it once, like behind the stage, like an hour before showtime. And yeah, it's yeah, and it's probably like, yeah, I heard the song plenty of times. Yeah, you know, yeah. 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 You guys ever tour with Lincoln Park or no? We've met up at like different festivals and stuff, but we seem to like run into like members of like Lincoln Park, and, yeah. like random places, which is kind of weird. <laughs> uh, but they're nice guys. They seem nice enough. Yeah, yeah, they had a good experience. Yeah, that's awesome. Before Warped, you guys came off the very successful What Is the Burn X tour. It was huge. Yeah, was wonderful. Just gigantic. You guys arenas played. sold out. <laughs> yes, arenas just like Starline Ballroom here in uh, Sarahville, New Jersey. <laughs> uh, we class that by that as like a mini arena. Those do exist. Exactly. <laughs> See, this was the um, the smaller shows for you guys. <laughs> but anyways, how, how that all come about? Like, what um, what did you do to plan it? You guys are like, all right, this is ten years of this. Maybe we should play the whole album. <laughs> it started with like the two. Like, we got. It was very difficult to like get us all on board. But yeah. when it finally happened, we. Agreed to like two shows which were going to be at, at the Pomona Glass House and that like you know snowballed into four awesome amazing sold out shows which we released a DVD for but um, we're like let's just keep going yeah let's add a, you know, a London show and then like let's I'm sure the demand was there you know surprising yeah we get a lot of hate mail to our Facebook like you fucking assholes come to my city <laughs> so we're like we'll be there <laughs> yes yes uh, we yeah. did not expect the response that we got and you know, we just kept rolling with it you know we took it as far as we could like respectfully take it yeah, <laughs> yeah. How, how many different legs like three four 
Yeah. yeah. It's like you did, you did the States, then you went over to uh, England, which got like a gigantic response. I've seen the videos. Yeah. You came back to the States for another run. And yeah. yeah, then we did yeah. Asia and Australia. We did Asia, yeah, yeah. that too. Holy yeah. we got to get to South America, though. Yeah. Maybe we'll do a 15-year anniversary in South America. Man, my bones are already hurting. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that, that'd be awesome for them. I'm pretty sure they'll all want that. This is your final day on Warp Tour. You guys are playing uh, two more off dates after, I think, one in Ohio and one in Chicago, I think. Yeah, yeah we got to drive home, so we thought we'd play some shows. Yeah, might as well, you know, you're, you're on the way. Yeah. <laughs> so, what do you guys uh, have planned after? Release the new record. Yes. Uh, Back to Oblivion in September. That's coming out, and then we get to go to go do a couple shows in Asia. Um, do some more England shows. Alright. And then come back in October to do a full headlining US tour with uh, Maps and Atlases. Oh, great bands, yeah. Yeah, super yeah. great. Yeah, awesome, awesome. All right, so uh, last question. Uh, this podcast that I do is about music, concerts, and I also like to give tips to you know up and coming bands and stuff like that on what they should do, what they should not do, stuff like that. So you guys been a band for what, like 15 years off and on? Yeah, something like that. 14. Yeah. Yeah, 14. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we started when I was 18, and now I'm 32, so it's been a while. Yeah. So, any advice to the guys that are thinking about jumping in a van and playing like random VFWs? <laughs> um, I would say just be smart, don't be an asshole, learn your instrument and play it well. Yes. The uh, best you can do is just go on stage and I guess shred and rip and you know, just tear it up. Yep. Yeah. Practice your heart out and write, write, write and don't be a dick to the crew. <laughs> exactly. You know, there's a lot of bands that this don't guy yells at his part. bass deck. I don't, know. He, 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 I don't know why he's even saying that. He this isn't a drop day? What the hell? Yeah. I don't have a bass tech. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so, yeah, that's about it, guys. Thank you so much for doing this. It Thank means you. a lot. This is actually my first, you know, real Warped Tour doing interviews and stuff. So, cool. All right. awesome. Well, you guys are a part of it. Success, man.